Say hi. Say hi guys. So today I'm going to be doing a tag video called the YouTube Mommy Friend Tag. And I was tagged by the gorgeous Amanda Muse. So yeah, basically it's just a tag where you go through like these hypothetical scenarios of like which YouTube mommies you would call on to help you through those particular situations. And Sadie's going to join me as long as she's, uh, <laughs> whoa, yay. <laughs> well, you know, the first question is you're going to a fancy event, but you have nothing to wear. Whose closet do you raid? Okay, so for this I chose Allison Barr from Raising the Bars. I would definitely want to wear a dress to like anything fancy and I think that she's got a really cute style. It's very feminine and girly but at the same time it looks comfortable. So I would definitely raid her closet and also I would uh, raid wherever she keeps her jewelry too because she's got really <laughs> cute jewelry that she pairs with everything. I'm not really that fancy with jewelry. Um, so my next question is your child is having a birthday party who do you ask to bake the cake I would definitely pick <laughs> uh, for this one Joanne from hatched by two chicks I don't know if y'all watch her or not but she is just first of all an amazing like thanks for kicking my phone off <laughs> an amazing cake artist and she can do like special like diet restrictions like gluten-free anything um, and also if I ever needed a, um, a penis cake <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. Uh, I would totally have her do it. Uh, she's just an awesome, hilarious person and um, goes the extra mile for like party planning and, and baking and all that stuff. So definitely Joanne. Um, number three, you had a huge fight with your husband. Who do you call? I would call Miss Brandy Bailey and her channel is Starsense87. And I would definitely call her just because first of all, she is just an amazing person like inside and out she's dropped a gorgeous and yes I'm totally plugging her channel right now you should go subscribe if you haven't already but um yeah she's just a really smart like wise beyond her years kind of person and she would just be she's just a great listener like if there's anything I've ever gone through in the last like two or three years I've, I've I know that I can go to her and be completely honest and she's not gonna judge me she's she's gonna give me um, advice when it's needed but she's also not going to like judge me if I make my own decision or if I like take a different direction than maybe what she suggested so does that make any sense yeah and also she's just really like easy to relate to since she's you know gone through her own divorce and she's, she's not the kind of friend that'll like talk trash on your husband <laughs> if you get in a fight with him. She'll just listen and think that's what a good supportive friend does. Anyways, that's my really long answer, but I would definitely pick Brandy. Number four, your house is on the market. You need help staging it. Who do you choose to help decorate? Um, for this, I chose Jenny, Candid Mommy. Um, I chose her because I think that she, first of all, just does a really great job of like DIY projects and throwing things together and kind of like incorporating themes throughout different rooms in her home. Um, I think she did a great job just throwing together her her single mommy um, home on a budget because she's newly single and um, yeah I, I would definitely just pick her. Number five, you want a weekend getaway for two and you had and you have no babysitter. Who do you ask to babysit your children? I would pick for this Giovanna <laughs> from Baby Ava and Giovanna. I would pick her because what, what would two more kids be in her pile of kids that she always has around like I could just throw my kids in. She would just take care of them. She's like super mom. Um, she's always like baking amazing treats for her daughter's like class at school and um, taking her kids and these other kids that she watches to like, I don't know. She's just a great fun mom to begin with and she's just good with other people's kids too. So I would trust her. You have to take new family portraits but can only ask a YouTube mommy to do them. Um, who can you ask? Okay, so I'm totally cheating on this one. Um, I couldn't pick just one because I actually have so many different moms on here that I think are really talented photographers. There's uh, Sierra Pearl from Pearl Darling. There's, um, yeah, there's just a ton. Um, but the, the two that I picked that I think um, would not only do like great family portraits, but also like if I ever wanted them to film like my birth or anything, or I guess take pictures of my birth. Um, I picked Kayla from Kaylin Sky and also Kayla Gonzalez. And um, the other Kayla, uh, I'll leave her channel name, I'll leave both of them below. Um, it's, I can't think of it off the top of my head. I think it's K 
Kay Gonzalez 87 maybe? I don't know. They're both really, really talented and especially my friend Kayla from Kayla and Sky. She is, um, she hasn't been actually doing it that long, but she has grown so much over the last like two years that it's not even funny. Yeah, I would definitely pick both of them. Um, let's see, number seven, your next door neighbor's house is vacant. Who do you choose to be your next door neighbor? This is hard because I would, there's there's honestly a lot of people that I would like to pick and just start like a little YouTube mommy village in my neighborhood. That would be like my dream. But if I could only pick one, um, I would pick Raven. I don't know what her, her channel name is anymore. I will have to insert that here too. Um, she is a cool Austin, Texas mommy. She just vlogs a lot about her garden and her family and, and her journey with like kind of just different, kind of crunchy, crunchy. She's got a little boy that is like literally a day he was born like a day before Jack so they're almost exactly the same age he would have so if they lived next door Jack would always have like a little friend to play with and she could come help me straighten out my garden because my garden's a hot mess I don't know what I'm doing <laughs> so she could help like teach me and um, I don't know she would just be really fun to talk to I think she's a really awesome chick so if I could pick two neighbors I would definitely pick a man muse except Instead of her coming to live next door to my house, I would want to go live next door to her house in Malaysia because, oh my god, she lives in freaking Malaysia. It just seems like such a cool place to live. And I totally stalk her channel on Instagram. Not just because she lives in Malaysia, but because she's just awesome in general. But um, yeah, I think that would be fun. So I'm adding my own little twist on that question. The question was, you're getting ready for a hot date but need help doing your makeup. Who do you call on? Um, for this, I chose Courtney Bishop from GNC Bishop. Um, I chose her because I know how to do makeup, but w the reason I would choose her is because she would make me look like over the top hot. <laughs> Not just like regular natural, she would make me look like sexy because she's got the smoky eye down, the false lashes, the nude lip, the, you know, the bronzed cheek, like she, would do just a really great job. And some of that stuff's like kind of outside my comfort zone because I'm not that good at doing smoky eyes. Sometimes I feel kind of awkward in a like nude lip, but um, I know that if she were to come do my makeup, she would do a really good job. And so, yeah, I would pick Courtney for that. <laughs> okay, so number nine, you're giving birth. Who do you ask to be your doula? Okay, so I also cheated again and I picked two. This is really hard. I have so many like birthy friends, but I actually have friends that are professional doulas too. So it was a tie between Megan Martin and Kayla from Kayla and Sky. Um, Megan Martin, her, her channel is rmartin92405. Throughout my whole pregnancy and even like early in labor, what are you doing? <laughs> Even early in labor, I was like texting them. I'm like, ah, I lost my mucus plug on oh, bloody show. Like I'd be updating them. Like even up to like nine centimeters, I was texting like Megan saying like, oh, I'm still okay. Like I just really trust them. And I think that they would be great birth support. You know, they've been there. They've both had natural births before I had. I just trusted them completely. And I honestly think that they, they're, they're just really special people who would do a great job. Yeah, and I used Kayla for two different answers, so I know that's double cheating, but whatever. So number 10 is, okay, you're stuck in the wilderness with a YouTube mommy with no food. Who do you choose? Okay, so I'm gonna have to agree with you, Amanda, on this one. Um, I totally picked Genevieve from Mama Natural. I think that she, um, she just knows. What are you doing? <laughs> Too silly. What are you doing? Like, I think she'd be really good at like camping and knowing like which foods you can eat and what, what has protein and like what has, she, and she would like know all about which essential oils are in certain plants if I like got a scrape or a sunburn or something. So I'd pick her. And those are my answers for the tag. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, if you're watching and you want to do this yourself, go ahead and do it. And if I tagged you, then you really, really have to do it, don't you? We said so. Oh, okay. You can teeth on my finger again. <laughs> all right, guys. I will see you guys later. And if uh, if you guys could check out all of the channels of the people I tagged, that'd be great. You should totally subscribe because they're all really awesome. See, we'll see you guys later. Bye.